surprise, I know you aren't ready for it, but it is time to talk about holiday shopping. And we're here today to share with you some wonderful ideas for gifts for gardeners. Up here in the front of the table, I've got some things from Crabtree and Evelyn. They provide us with wonderful hand cream that soothes those rough, worn hands after you spend a long day in the garden and continually wash your hands. They also make a beautiful um, analgesic cream with lavender oil, and it soothes those scrapes and cuts that you might sometimes develop while working hard in the garden. So think about these things from Crabtree and Evelyn at a cost of about $20 to $25. The Perfect Pickler people have got a variety of fermentation kits on their website, ranging from about $20 to $80, variety of sizes, and you can actually turn the cucumbers that you grow into pickles and enjoy them that way. In addition, they have wonderful recipes on their website for things like um, kimchi, and this is the one I'm trying next, mushroom ceviche. Yum. If you're a gardener, it likes ornamentals and is interest, or is interested in fairy gardening, you might consider a terrarium kit. There are a variety of websites online that offer that combination of plants and, and glass bowls that your gardener will have a wonderful time putting together. The last thing on my list is a trug. <laughs> These are wonderful, versatile, plastic trugs, very, um, Durable. Durable, they last a long time. They come in a variety of beautiful colors, lots of sizes, from about $13 to $17 for these. And they're really handy. My husband stole the last one. Yeah, and bought, I've had so. mine for a long time. Very, very durable. Okay, my turn. The other things that we have here on the table to show you is let's start with seeds. Um, every gardener wants seeds, they want flowers and they want vegetables. And the nice thing about this, this, if they're on sale, could be like a dollar a packet up to about four or five dollars. Absolutely great uh, stocking stuffers. Um, wintertime, they don't maybe not get to garden as much as they want to, but they sure can read about gardening. This is a magazine that comes out four times a year. It's called Heirloom Gardening. And it comes from, I believe, is it Baker Seed? Baker Creek yes. Seed. Baker yes. Creek Seed, yes. And you can find that online, $15 for four. And online it is at? Rareseeds.com. Rareseeds.com. Thank you, Kathy. <laughs> um, other things we've got. Now, if, if the budget's a little bit higher and you want to spend between 80 and actually above $100, you can get an arrow garden. I love mine. Um, they are water gardens. You can grow herbs. I grow basil in mine because I like basil and I have it all year long in my arrow garden. The other thing that I've got on my list here is this book. And this book is from the Four Season Farm. It is a gardener's cookbook. The best part about this is the beginning of the book tells you how to grow the garden. The back half of the book tells you how to cook what it is you grew. And the very, very best gift we have to tell you about today is a symposium for your gardener. It's being given by the Colorado Master Gardeners of Jefferson County. It's happening on the 24th of January, $75. And your gardener will get an entire day of gardening tips about how to create soil to grow what they want to grow saving seeds, planting seeds, and lunch. So um, that, if you are interested in that one, it's online, look, at, look after CSU, and that's where you'll find that information. Kathy? Well, we hope we've given you some ideas to think about for the gardener in your life. The best gifts are often those that highlight special characteristics of an individual, and we know. We know. Gardeners are the most special of all. <laughs> Merry Christmas, and thank you for watching. Merry gardening. <laughs>